So I'm just doing vault plus 15. I'm 949 equipped with one legendary, so I'm just going to do this, so I'm geared up for Mythic tonight because I'm tanking Portal Keeper. And at the moment, with two legendaries, or with one legendary, sorry, I can't. So yeah, this week's pretty easy, so I'm probably just going to pull a lot. Pull these scorpions and the uh, crocodile. I'll probably pop wings soon, I'll probably pop wings now. And guardian. And then just stack them all up. I'll pop horn as well, because it's just easier. Do my artifact, take less damage. And then just shield this crocodile and just start... Dropping. Sanguine should start dropping now, so I'll try and drop it towards. Yeah, that's good. And then I think I can pull the next set of worms because we should be fine. Then just slow all these guys down and just keep doing this. And I'll just bring them back further and further. So that scorpion's dead, so he's gonna drop sanguine. That's quite bad because oh no, the worms are fine. So I just drop the Nasher. I'm gonna move over here because. I need to drop the sanguine further over here. I'll get threat from these because it might be dropping. Pick up threat on that guy. And just connect with these. Oh, he's in sanguine. Someone's stunned him. Just taunt him so I keep up the threat and just get rid of these crawlers so they don't drop sanguine in awkward places. Oh, accidentally lay on hands. I'm just going to pull this croc and then just get the sanguine to settle down here. And then just slowly start to kite them down. I'm going to pull the ad three ads here because for some reason people don't pull these when you need it for the extra percentage. Just kill this. It's good when you have a DK because it can give you water walking, but this is fine as well. Pull these up so the sanguine gets placed in a good place. I'm not sure what happened to that mob, but I'm just gonna um, do that. Okay, so we reset. That's fine. Okay, so the healer's jumping, so it's fine because I'll just self heal. I'm just gonna pop Avengers then, since he's gone down. Get ready to place the sanguine, and I'll move these guys further down. I'm just going to give this major heal. There he goes. Get ready to place this one. And. Come on. Come on. Come on. Get ready to do pull timer. Pull. Twist them. Torn. Get that ad. See how much DPS they can do. Pick these ads up. Joking dust. I'm just going to move the boss like quite far in here. Well, not far in because I need the uh, range to hit it. They're killing the ad, so I might not. I need. I don't, might not need to taunt them. I'm just going to taunt this ad quick. I'm just going to use the defensive here to be safe because this boss is a bit awkward. Like you don't know when to pop defense. I'm just going to move over here because yeah. I got a vengeance shield on that ad, so I should be fine. The DPS is pretty good, like pretty insane, so. I can see the key going well, but it's a completely random pug. I had no idea who I was fighting. Razor shards. Oh, I just pop wings here. And then just kill him off quickly there we go, easy go on to the next one I'm just gonna care here because obviously avalanche hurts quite a lot with fortified but let's see
I just run past these because it's really awkward to tank the uh, pelter because he just jumps around like a little. Oh, the pet pulled. It's unfortunate. I'll just stun this guy or. Ooh. No one dead yet. I'm just going to stick on this pelter because if he jumps towards the drummer, it just cuts you so bad. Although that's the avalanche one, I don't think it will one shot us if we're all full. Hopefully we can kill it before the next avalanche. No, we can't. Well, I'm not sure how that. Oh, that mage is dead, but fair enough. We did alright. It's expected. I'm just going to try and get to these quick so I can taunt them. There we go. Avalanche. Oh, no one's dead. That's good. I'm just going to get them in this corner. And I'm going to save wings for the next pack because the next pack hurts a lot. Hopefully, we can get a stun on these. They are not moving, but yeah. I'm going to save my stun for the next avalanche pack because I don't think I'll get another one off now. No, you probably won't. I'm not going to kill the drummer because reasons. No way, I actually might kill him for percentage because. You know, percentage is not going to hurt anyone. So, now, has he got mana? Yeah, he does. Okay, so I'm going to pop wings. And do big damage. Pop Crusader. And then just heal anyone up if they drop low. Yeah, both dead because they were low. Couldn't heal them quick enough. It's just what happens though with Fortified and this pack. It's just insane to heal. Avalanche again. It's just people don't really know how to dodge it. Like, people are just awkward about it. As long as the breaker dies, it's fine. I'm going to pull the breaker over here so he just doesn't... I'm going to stun the breaker next if he gets another avalanche. Ooh, that was a clutch stun. And now we can just kill the pelters normally. I'll heal this mage because... Reasons. I can probably push on to the next pack soon, but... I can probably go now. I can probably go now, yeah. So I'll go now. Just to keep the speed going. Heal myself. Self heal. Use my artifact just to know that I'll stay alive. I'm just going to CC this guy. I'm just going to turn this boss out a bit because I don't know if he'll get stuck. I'm going to get ready to rebuke this out. Yeah, done. Ugh. Is he's gonna see on me. Gucci. Yeah, he's on me. I probably should have popped defensives there. On the shards. I'm just gonna stun this guy. I'm just gonna stun the Hulk next time he does shards. Hopefully he won't do any more. I don't know if it was because he did, I got a bolt and then a, um, and then, uh, the shards, but I've got no idea. Just going to taunt them into this corner. And then just twist him over here. I'll use, um, Crusader. Oh, God. That was bad. That was really bad. I've got to make sure this had Stacy Seed. <sighs> Clutch cell feels. He's got Trank up good. 
the weirdest shit I've seen. Oh, I'm dead. I'm a retard because I LOS the healer. That was retarded of me. I just had no defensive left, so I probably could have bubbled. If I didn't get knocked down, I survived that, but... It's that knockback, it's just AIDS. And we don't have enough stuns to, like, just lock them down. Let's go, next one. Okay, so... I'm just gonna bring these two down here. Just so I've got more space for the, um... For the next pack. I'm just gonna stun this guy on his avalanche. Just got it off in time, that was really good. Just... Oh, it didn't go off. Okay, no one's dead, so... I'll kick the next stone bolt, there we go. Because he's slowed, so I'll just move him out this angle and quick. And we can just kill this guy. And then I'll tank the Hulk, like, round about here. There we go. So now... If this pack moves, I'll tank the Hulk up against this. I use Crusader on the first, yeah, piercing shards. There we go. And then I'm gonna just pop wings on this because obviously we died to the pack last time. Self heal a bit. Pop my artifact. Self heal myself. Piercing shards. I'm just gonna pop Guardian here because obviously I've just gotta be like triple safe. There we go. So I'm just going to pull these two before, so we've got CDs. Just get them to hold their CDs, so... I'll probably pull the pelt. I'm just going to pull the pelt, and not the pelt, the uh, shaper now. And the geode. Because it just allows us to get our CDs back up for the next pack, which is going to be an absolute dick fest. That was a bit of a cook. They can move him out if we interrupt him. Okay, good. God, it's a bit of a cook, but it happens. Because, see, I've nearly got wings back up, so it's just a really big help. If you can, yeah, vortex them on pull. I'm just gonna pop ardent defender once they start. I'm just gonna get my get ready to use my stun for the um, avalanche. Stun him now. Then pop my wings. Put down all my shield. Big damage. Put down all my shields. Self heal the mages so you know helps the healer out. Do that. Another self heal. Self heal myself up a bit. I'm gonna get ready. I just usually lay on hands on this mage so we don't get people to die. See, there we go. So easy. Just time to pop us on this one because obviously we want it to be up for last. So pull him. It doesn't matter about that sanguine because I'll just pull him backwards, like towards here. Okay, good. They time up. So I'm just gonna pop, you know, a few defensives. Just to let the healer get used to how much damage I'll be taking. Because, you know, obviously, I've only got one legendary. If I don't get a legendary before the raid tonight at um, 7, I'm just going to buy the auction house one. Because it's decent defensive and it's stats, so...
No, I didn't see which one it was. I should have been more aware. Oh. Okay. So, hit that one. Just Avenger shield it. Okay, that's good. Strike of the mountain. Oof. Stack him up next to them. Yeah, it's good because we have a lock, so his dots are staying on him. Hopefully, we can push his push this guy so he dies in this phase. I'm just gonna pop a pre pot so maybe he does die in this phase. Just gonna spam shield, self heal, horn. Hopefully, get an Avenger shield proc soon. I'm just gonna focus on DPS and just self heal myself when I can. I'm gonna pop a. I'm just gonna pop a defensive now just to be safe. So I don't have to self-heal, and I can use my GCDs on my DPS. I didn't actually pop it. Okay, I popped it now. We just got to get him down. To, if he gets around to, like, about five, the locks uh, dots are going to kill it. Maybe. There we go. Yeah, I see. Locks dots are killed it. So I'm going to do crocodiles now. Instead of the old, um... This pack, because obviously... Crocodiles have no spells. Torn. Crusaders. There we go, hit him as well, nice. That was really nice. Pop shield, put my artifact, and self heal. And just drag them up. Because we have all the frost, so we can just slow them all the way up. I just put down my hammers and kite them. Just keep using my hammers. I'll probably just pop wings here just so it helps. Helps DPS them down a bit and I can probably just stand here and hit them. Just probably move them now. I'm just going to, wherever the worm spawns, I'll just torn it instantly. The small one, that is. Yeah, there we go. Torn it. Just get judgment on that one so he comes back. I'm just going to bring this worm with us because... I'm going to pop Guardian here. And just blinding light them. Okay, that Geode's going to drop a bit of Sanguine, so I'll drag them out. Okay, so that, we got to make sure this doesn't go into meta. Okay, good. Yeah, the DPS are quite good on that front, where they're killing the ants. After the Worm and the Grub are down, I'm probably just going to pull the next pack, so I can get the Sanguine now. Okay, I'll do the next pack now. Self heal, use health stone. I'm dead probably. Wings OP. Pop horn. Self heal, self heal. It was probably bad uh, pulling that Grib Lord, but. Just pull them back up here. Hit this Grub Lord. Pull back here and stun this ad. So they know about it, kind of thing. Kill him. That will go. Yeah, this worm's dead. I just killed this worm before because obviously we knew how it killed last time, but it healed in Sanguine, so. Hit, hit, hit. Pull the next up. I'm going to pop. Um, 
I don't think I need to pop any defensives because of Frozen Orb. I'm just going to save my steeds for uh, the boss. And yeah. I'll probably stun this if it's off cooldown. Because I don't want that worm to drop. Because it just wastes time. There we go, stun him. And just pull the boss instantly. It doesn't really matter about the healer's mana because it's not Tyran. Just gonna pop wings instantly. And just self heal. Toxic, right? Oh my god, I'm retarded. Hopefully they have a CR. Okay, they do good. That was really bad of me there because the toxic reach just like pretty much killed me. There we go. So yeah, I've got to pop defensives on that. Just gonna horn a Valor. Because if I need to as well, I can literally just pop um, bubble. Because the boss only hits the closest melee to it. So obviously I'm the closest melee still because no we've got we've got no melee so I'll bubble and he'll still hit me. So I won't need to um worry about killing a spike tongue over so I run so I get hit. Run out of the goo on the floor because that's what killed me first time. And just keep self healing, Arjun. If I go low here, I'm just gonna pop the health stone just to be triple safe. Yeah, I'm just gonna do it. Okay, Gucci, let's go. Might be a two chest, might be a one. I'm just going to stun on the avalanche. Just going to get ready for it. Stun it. Pop wings. See if I got enough percentage. Yeah, I think I easily do. Gonna be a close one, that's what I'll say. Self heal. Bang. Next bit. I'm just going to stun this pelter because it just helps you out. helps everyone out. I'm just going to blind them. Okay. Hopefully we can get big deeps out. Just going to help the healer out with healing the DPS because if they get unlucky and get like two pelts or three pelts in a row, they're dead. Don't think we've got enough time. Self heal the lock. Just pop wings here, speed up a bit. Self heal him. Get ready to go on the next pack quickly. We won't have enough time. There's no point rushing it and dying, so... I'm just gonna stun the Dominator, just... Heal up the mage.
Has he got mana yet? Oh no, he hasn't. I'll just go now. Well, I'm happy with a one chest, to be honest, because I've only got one legendary. So I wasn't expecting miracles. I've got to put my shield here so I don't get crashed. There we go. Just going to watch behind me and make sure no one's... um. Just going to pop shield. Okay, good. Didn't get knocked away. Just tell them what to do because obviously they're in it. And slide. Get ready to hide. Two shields so don't get knocked away. Okay, good. Just gonna use a horn here so I can get some DPS off on Giant as he moves. It's big DPS. Get ready to use shield. Use shield now. This mage is retarded. I don't know if he's just trying to kill the boss now. Probably is. But anyway. There we go. 